filing your statement. Why? Because he, he knows it's a lie. Raina doesn't know Jack. He wasn't there. I was. Dante, look. Everybody gets you dealing with a lot. You were shot point blank by a man who turned out to be your father. But then Sonny came in and he worked it. While you were recovering from surgery, he pulled out his little violin and he played the concerned and loving dad. And you don't have to fall for that, pal. It's not too late to just be honest and tell the truth. Look, I'm standing by my statement, okay? I shot myself. You know how crazy that sounds? Dante Falconeri, experienced undercover officer. He does some Keystone Cop routine with a loaded gun. Yeah, save your breath, Ronnie. Why are you perjuring yourself to save this guy's ass? Look, I get you share some DNA, but so what? Okay, Sonny, he's a killer. Go ahead and tell Rayner you delivered his message. Lieutenant Paletti was your friend and your mentor. He's the reason you became a cop. He dedicated his life to fighting organized crime. Okay, and he died for it. On Sonny's orders. So help me out here, okay? Help Look, me Look, Sonny's already going you, to prison on murder charges on a case that I built. All right? All I'm... Dante, look, there's a reason that your mother kept quiet all these years about Sonny being your father. Because the man is a killer, okay? And he has no respect for the law. And he proved that when he knowingly shot a cop. Yeah, like I said in my official statement, my shooting was an accident. Do you, do you think that Sonny actually gives a damn about you? Now that he knows you're related? Are, are you actually buying into this myth that he's a great father? Michael Corinthos took a bullet meant for his super dad, okay? And now he's forcing the kid to cover up what he knows about Claudia's murder. Hey, look, Sonny is a blight on his kids. I know that. And they need to be set free of him, and that's going to happen soon. When he's behind bars for Claudia's murder. Well, what happens if you don't have Claudia's murder waiting in the wings? What happens if there's no fallback position? And it's just you and your testimony that'll keep Sonny from walking away clean again for the 15, 20, 100th well, well, time. Unfortunately, that's, that's not the situation we're in. Sonny's attorneys are the best. They could puncture a hole in the most airtight case. And they could do it with Claudia's murder. Are you okay with Sonny walking away free again for shooting another cop? And spitting on, on Vince Pauletti's memory and everything Sonny that he stood for? Rest. You should leave. Eternal Affairs is going to be all over this because it looks exactly like what it is. An officer giving a false statement to protect the perp. You're throwing away your badge. For what? Hey. So, uh, <laughs> looks like I'll be uh, looking at career opportunities. You think you'd still love me if I was a garbage collector? We got a problem. What now? Someone in the organization, a guy that we thought we could trust, he knows enough to put us both away. Okay, go ahead and take care of it. There are too many loose ends. We need to tighten things up and let everybody know that this loyalty comes with a price. All right, good. That's what I thought you'd say. Who's the traitor? Dante? Olivia. Olivia. You gotta talk to your son. If anybody could get through to him, it's you. My son is a grown man, Ron, with the courage of his convictions. Okay, I got no intention of getting through to him Look, about it's, anything. It's messing with his head that Sonny's his father. Okay, now Dante's actually lying to protect well, this guy. You know, I'd be real careful about spouting off accusations like that, Ron. My kid is a man of integrity. Look, I get I get why you didn't tell Dante Sonny was his father. He wanted to protect him and keep him out of Sonny's life. Okay, and you did that. Mm -hmm. He's a dedicated cop. They don't come any better. Yeah. But he's about to throw it all away. I'm going to be proud of my son no matter what he does. Look, <laughs> when his career goes out the window... His integrity is going to go with it. Okay, well, All to protect this guy who tried to kill him. This is what I see happening here. 
Okay, you thought you had a shortcut to get Sonny put away with this whole situation. That didn't work out for you, right? So how about this? How about you get off your butt and you start working to put Sonny away for Claudia's murder? Dante already did all the work. All you gotta do is ride home on his coattails. Dante is not thinking straight. And Sonny's exploiting it. He's trying to get a toehold in his life. You wanna help your son? Then tell him to stick to his principles got, and do what's I right. I've got no doubt that that is what my kid is doing oh, already. God. How, how long we know each other, long time. Olivia? Yeah, well, we go way back. Since Dante and I were kids, right? But you and Sonny, you guys grew up together. He was your first big love. Maybe the loyalty's still there. My loyalty is to my son. Yeah, but you won't let Sonny get put away. So you're standing there, and you're actually... You're actually choosing him over your own child. So maybe this whole thing about, you know, wanting to protect Dante, maybe it was just a big load of crap. Don't you dare ever question my love for my son, you two-bit goomba. Yeah, that's right. Except for the badge, I don't see a whole hell of a lot of difference between you and the no-neck thugs that Sonny's got running around through this town. That's right, you're an opportunist, Ron. You're trying to exploit my kid's pain to get what you want. And there's not a chance in hell that I'm gonna let that happen, okay? So why don't you get your ass out of here before I go to your wife and I tell her all the times you stepped out on her in the name of protecting your cover. How about that? You think I knew about that, did you? I want you to leave. As soon as you and the kids do the same. It's not a reasonable explanation for you to be staying at a mobster's house now, is it? I trust Jason. Okay, could you put aside the relationship with Jason and your anger toward me just for the moment and think about the kids? Oh, this coming from a man who did everything he could to put their father in prison? Because I was trying to protect them. No, you weren't. You did it for yourself, Jax. Because you hate Sonny, you hate that he's a permanent part of my life because of the kids, and you saw a chance to take him down, and you took oh, yes, it. yes, of course. It, it had nothing to do with, with, with the fact that Michael was in a coma for a year, and that, that that crazy wife of Sonny's kidnapped you at gunpoint when you were pregnant, and you and the baby almost died. On top of that, Michael now has to live with the fact that he killed someone, had nothing to do with any of that. And, and Sonny shot a cop, huh? In his own living room, who happened to be his son. It's an accident. Are you saying it was an accident? That's what Dante told the investigators. It was an accident and he shot himself. The way everyone thinks I lied to protect Sonny, the truth is I want Sonny in prison. I saw what he is. When he pulled the trigger, he was cold. He, he, he underneath all that charm and, and the good boss and the good father. I mean, he had no emotion, ice in his eyes. You know, when you cross Sonny, nothing will stop him from getting revenge. I mean, it meant nothing to him that I saved his and Morgan's life. I was the enemy, and he wanted me dead. I'm sorry. It's my own fault. I got sentimental and sloppy. And, you know, if I got shot because of it, that's, that's just my fault. Okay, I think you're being too hard on yourself, but that doesn't matter. You just need to decide what you want to do, and I will support you. You sure you don't want to rethink that? I mean, if they take away my badge, I don't know. Maybe the PCPD needs a janitor? You honestly think you could lose your job over this? And Ronnie does. I don't know, me, I'm, I'm counting on Sonny being convicted for killing his wife. I think you need to close your eyes and rest. You've had too many visitors. You look terrible. It really turns me on when you sweet talk. <laughs> Sleep. But then I won't be able to look at your pretty face. I'm glad you appreciate it. I had to endure Maxie slathering on makeup to cover the bags under my eyes. That's, uh... That's real love right there. Dante had a chance to put me away.